uh, a lot of things have changed in the past 12 months. A lot of things have changed. And after that 5-7 and seven season, you know, Coach Pinkles talked about how these seniors have been on a quiet mission to really bring the respect back in this Mizzou program. But LaDamian Washington told me that Coach Pinkle has a chip on his shoulder, too. Before games, Coach Pinkle is intense. I'm, you know, ready to stab myself. He's focused. We call it the grind hero. He doesn't eat and... Well, I don't sleep. But it works. Pinkle is tied with Don Ferro as the winningest coach in Mizzou history. And even though... I never did this to, to break records. It just goes to show how old he is and how long he's been around. <laughs> <laughs> and it's crazy to think that at the beginning of the season, some people had him on the hot seat. Me on the hot seat? You kidding me? That, that, was that out there? I didn't know that. <laughs> Joking aside, he's battled through adversity before. The DUI happened and, um, you know, things that happened with the divorce. And his mentor, Don James, passed away earlier this year. He's had a, just a profound uh, um, uh, influence on me. Ever since that day, I mean, he's been doing a lot better job coaching. I mean, so Pinkles moved from the hot seat to the driver's seat with the chance to win an SEC championship. He'll be the greatest coach when he leaves here. For Mizzou Extra, I'm here at Begoth, KOMU 8 News.